Alright, so you may be wondering why I'm recording uh, so what seems to be an ordinary duel. Well, except here's the one, here's the thing. It's not an ordinary duel. This is the duel that got me to motherfucking gold rank. You'll never guess who I played as. Surprise, surprise! We've won the one! <laughs> oh my god, this adorable cinnamon roll cinnamon with an S, by the way, deserves, he deserves more attention. He's the cutest. I like how I'm letting all my my fellow duelists know who I ship to <laughs> with my uh, freaking Grax playmat. <laughs> Gee, Akiza's voice actually sounds familiar. <laughs> oh yeah, some you'll find enemy controllers like it's a tie between that and Pyre the Guardians is for my favorite spell card. My favorite trap is probably a uh, wall of disruption. I, I see it a lot. And when I first started using a, like facing against this Akiza player, I'm like, oh my god, not another Aroma deck. Because I think pretty much everybody except those who use Aroma decks hate Aroma decks. I fucking hate Aroma and Witchcrafter decks so bad. You have no idea. Also, I'm really glad I used um, Dust Tornado here because I got screwed over so many times by um, mag Dark Magical Circle and um, uh, what's the other one? Magician Navigation because combined those two can really wreck house. So yeah, I'm glad I had Dust Tornado right when I did. It's coming! <laughs> Uh, the voice, uh, obviously the voice, uh, the original voice actor for Weevil is like way better, but this guy isn't too bad. I don't know if I've, I might have mentioned that before. Dang it, would have been even better if I was facing against Yusei, because it looks like it's a known fact that Yusei hates insects. That would have made this victory even more satisfying. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, Naturia Butterfly is one of my favorite um, tuner monsters. In fact, it probably is my favorite tuner monster. I don't know, I feel like in these recordings I go away too many of my secrets. Ooh, see, this is the this is the move that really I thought like, oh my god, I'm done for, because like like I said, wall of disruption is like my probably my favorite trap card, because it really it'll, like look both of my monsters I have two monsters in attack position, zero attack. If this person drew um, a dark magician with that magician navigation, I would have been fucked <laughs> like so bad. The only thing I could have maybe done was like. Hope I draw a good monster. And by the oh, speaking of wall of <laughs> disruption, there it is. I get sent to my graveyard because of nature butterfly. But yeah, I guess the only thing I could have done was like reduce the attack of my armored bee. So I had the I had the notion to add a bunch of random synchros and XZ's monsters to pretty much all of my decks, like this one, Ancient Pixie Dragon, just for shits and giggles. And I'm like, ah, I'm never gonna summon it. I'm like. Mm, nope, it's actually helped me a lot. Like, just putting random synchros. Unfortunately, I only have two XZ's monsters. I, I, one of them is Zubaba General. I don't remember what the other one was. Some level, th I mean, rank 3 monster. With that fairy injection, whatever the fuck it was called. Kidney surgery. Honestly, if Weevil used DNA surgery instead of Parasite Parasite in that duel against Joey, he, well, actually, I don't know if it would have really made a difference. I mean, maybe. Yeah, if this person drew on um, Dark Magician, 
like at any point between when I synchro summon this or when, when that wall of activation was or wall of disruption was activated I would have been fucked over <laughs> but it's, yeah it's like opponent surrendered I don't know why I find that so funny opponent surrendered 